Cool. Hmm. Loonies, ah. Gelsi, Nepa, Batanavi Scansis, Domi Bayen, Kisanis Navy, Oompa Free, Broom Shaby, Bully Glanvoosh, uh, Ukina Game, <laughs> Omoof, Oh, Zopi, Vabo, at Sick of Flesh, Omoof, Sick of Foof, Wanna Fage Licker. Yanoborp, free nip, gung day yawara, genuix a flan, sabe, tomadar. Hmm. Oh, zilnoi. <laughs> oh. Oh. Zopi, vabo, at sick of flesh. <laughs> Sipane fras, sinoche, narfa, fazu wifta nebe. I'm a Freud. <laughs> Send you. Thank <laughs> you. 
Remember Shuba. Flash bigger. Send you. Huh. Huh. Oh, Rumba Shuba.
Thanks, Sir Noib. Free Nip Shashib. Blinkers say. Tuve. Hmm. Oh. Oosh. Who? Tomba Fwash. Oh. Tabi Funo. Why was there so many different noises for that explanation just then, Rainbow? I don't know. That's how noises is. Can I hear you on the stream? Can you? Well, I'm the only one watching. Oh. I hear my stuff pop a bit. That's okay, because I'm the only one watching it, so it's whatever. I mean, you can mute me. I, I can hear the echo you're hearing through my end. Oh yeah, I forgot about hygiene. Literally have to get a cheat code for that later. Actually, my computer's right here. A cheat code for hygiene on... What's the name of this game? The Sims 4. <laughs> Yeah, she, she's about to mute me, Jitter. Calm down. Yeah. Oh. 
I'm not wrong, there should be a whole vampire cheat for odorless. Why are there cheat codes for the snow? Mermaid cheats. You can become a mermaid? All right, yeah, there is a cheat code for hygiene. Uh, let me put that in now before my sim starts smelling like a ragamuffin. Lock, unlock, park. Go back to books. Not. Uh, how do I do this? It is. Uh, not that I hear. Fuck! I didn't mean to do that. The echo is still... It's not there? Okay. Good job. Alright, I think it's gone. Well, good job. Thank you. I did it. I put in the cheat code for stank, and now I don't stank. Mm, fuck you. What I was expecting. Boy. <laughs> you don't boy. Also, do that, to be honest. also, it's kind of just. No. Kinda <laughs> My sim randomly got off the building the rocket to go give his girl a kiss, and then now he's going to watch TV. What is with your sims, man? I don't. Wait, you can try for it, babe. You can woohoo in the rocket? Alright, bet. You can woohoo in a few places, but. Well, we about to go woohoo in the rocket. This gives me like all types of claustrophobic vibes right here. This hallway. This is a horror no, movie hallway. No, I kinda wanna draw it. I kinda wanna I wanna kinda wanna draw his death in semi and then um, pose. You good that's my guy? Lot. No, that's a lot. I'm not I'm not about that heartbreak life. I I'm gonna fucking cry at some point trying to do it. Bro, there there's no one in that seat. Are are you okay? My, my boy, <laughs> you good? <laughs> he might, he might need to be reset. Oh, nope, never mind. He, he, I think he's good. I want to upgrade my spaceship some more and then I'm going to go explore outer space. Who needs love when you can meet aliens? Oh. 
you know what? This is why you fell in school, always on that damn computer. Every time I look at you on this computer, always playing games. You need to be more like this dude and be working on spaceships. The fuck just fell? What was that? What happened? Why you make that noise? Oh, poor baby. We're laying down help. Every month. <laughs> yeah, but. I reached level six and building things. Woohoo! Yeah. I'm building a rocket. For the past 25 minutes, I've been building a rocket. Is that, is that my internet or is that your internet? Oh, what happened? I was watching the broadcast and it was just like, it had a little internet symbol with a mark on it. So, I don't know if that's mine or yours. More than likely mine. Yeah, mine says it's six. Mine says mine's disconnected. You said it disconnected. You said uh, mine's connected. Oh, yeah, it's probably my internet. you do if you was walking down the street and you just walked by a guy who's building a rocket in his yard mm. make sure that I'm not in his neighborhood <laughs> be like be like um I'm so what I'm not gonna lie I, I would be kind I would be somewhat interested in Somewhat concerned. Uh, uh, nah, I just, I'd be like, nah, that ain't it. <laughs> that ain't he's it. Gonna, he's gonna blow, he's gonna blow his house up. That's, that's my first thought. He's gonna blow his house up. 
I mean, that's a, that's an accurate first thought. You know, these things are generally built by a group of people, not a single person. Why would they? I don't think. I don't think it's illegal to build a spaceship. It's not illegal, but like, is it? I don't know. No, it's not, Jada. People have built tanks in their home, my guy. It is not illegal to build a vehicle. Alright? Now, it's illegal to do certain things with the things you decide to build in your yard. Yeah, that's what I meant, like. Like, if you built a spaceship, I'm pretty sure it's not legal to start that bitch and attempt to fly it. I could be wrong, because I, I, I've never had a reason to look up the laws for, can I build a spaceship in my yard? No, there's something I want to do. Let me save it here real quick, just in case I die while exploring the vacuums of space. <laughs> You're laughing, but that happens. Can yeah, you yeah, can. If mean, that's why I did the upgrades first, because I, once I ran out of fuck fuel up there, and I had to sit up in space until apparently space pirates decided to bring me back. My boy gone. Turbulence ahead. Carefully guides the rocket into orbit over a small alien world, but it's clear right away that something is wrong. Ionic interference in the planet's thermosphere is causing havoc with the ship's primary systems. The sides to take an attempt at emergency landing, which is smart since he has no other choice. See, look at that. I'm already getting into problems. I've been in space for 12 seconds and I'm already about to die. What? What? With the stabilizers Kythera installed, he is able to retain some control of the ship. It just barely misses a formation of sharp looking rocks and lands roughly in a swamp a few miles beyond. Struggling onto dry land, Kythera wonders how is he going to get the rocket out of the muck and back into space? Alright, so I landed in space mud. The green man. As the rocket sinks another inch into the swamp, Kythera suddenly spies a funny little green man hobbling over to him. Amazingly, the creature speaks perfect sim simlish. Help you, I can, he rasps. Well, almost perfect simlish. He offers to raise Kythera's ship from the swamp if he can pass a certain trials. Kythera agrees. Oh, God, I done met Space Yoda. Help you, I will. Answer my riddles, you might. Time for the first trial, it is. Raps, the creature, picks a number between 1 and 10. 4 says Kathura. Well done. Now the second trial. Hey, this is easy. The creature continues. Make me some lunch. You will. <laughs> Kathura can forage in the surrounding jungle or there might be something, some kind of fish in the swamp. Yeah, let's search the swamp. Why not? The final trial. From the swamp, Kythera pulls some kind of fish. The creature smiles, typically given only during a mating ritual, this is. He says, but ignore that for now. I will. The final trial is to explore the evil cave. The creature gives Kythera a weapon and oddly stresses that he will not need it. The fuck? Um, I, I guess I'm leaving the weapon. If I die in space... The Giga Kythera! Alright. Deep in the evil cave, Kythera encounters his ultimate challenge, Nega Kythera, and Kythera has no weapon, luckily. After explaining the situation, Nega Kythera agrees to just pretend like Kythera defeated him so Kythera can go home. Turns out Nega Kythera is pretty cool. Now to see if that funny creature can get the ship out of the swamp. Oh my gosh, it's like the scene from Scott Pilgrim vs. the World where he has to fight Nega Scott, but him and Scott kind of just got along. It was funny. I gotta upgrade my ship so this doesn't happen again.
How the fuck did I end up on this side of Pinterest? I don't understand. Cause you're weird. You're weird, boo. That's how. Talk about something you don't understand, like you ain't do it. Alright, you weird, boo. No, it was weird, weird stuff, won't it? It was like on Yowie Pinterest. No. What were you doing? Uh, People having problem is also references. You know what? I should have made a slave force. I should have had like 12 kids and make them slave to build my rocket for me. Always on that damn computer. Sway his hands like that. <laughs> On this ground I lay motionless in pain. I can feel my life crashing before my eyes. Can you not think before the lyrics hit? I have to. Was it all a thing? I will not die, I'll wait here for you, I feel alive, when you're beside me, I will not die, I'll wait here for you, in my time of dying. Alright, we're going back into space lane, bro. Space was easy. A, a populous toilet seat. Even in space, nature calls. Kythera docks with a star side rest station. It's pretty nasty in there. But then Kythera looks closely at the top of the toilet and discovers it's inhabited by teensy tiny alien civilizations. That's nasty. That's very nasty. Kythera, the supreme one. When the aliens see Kythera looming over them, they immediately fall to their knees and start chanting. They obviously think you're some sort of supreme being come to rule them. Should he stick around a while or just be on his way? Stay in rule, bro. Be a god for a bit. The aliens are pushing some pebbles around and desperately trying to start... A farm on a large pile of mold. Kythera can only think of two kinds of deities. The loving, benevolent kind and the angry, jealous kind. Be loving and benevolent. Mm. Benelev benevolent. Benevolent. Benev oh, my fuck. My English today is gone. Benevolent. Frick. Took me 34 minutes and 12 tries. Kythera studies the aliens closely. They appear to want more water to grow their crops. The loving, benevolent thing to do would be give them, right? Sprinkles of water. Build irrigation system. Hell yeah. He's about to be smart toilet seat monsters. Infrastructure for the future. The aliens will never again want water. Kythera is, Kythera is so benevolent. 
the aliens sing his praises. <laughs> They're now praising him for more land and fields and livestock. All right, I'm being a little too nice, the promise land. Praise to Kythera. He drags a table near the toilet so the alien colony can expand. <laughs> now that the aliens have all the land they need to build and grow, they seem to be doing okay. Kythera leaves on a high note or turn home. <laughs> I'm going one more trip. I forgot to save it. I hope I don't die. And the one time I didn't save going to space. Fuck. <laughs> rattle, rattle, crash. Kathir is on the way back from the Comet Esson flea market when he hears a banging inside his rocket ship cargo hold. He thinks back to recent salvage efforts. Nothing living, certainly. Should Kathir call out or try to take whatever it is by surprise? Take it by surprise. I ain't calling out the nothing. It's on my ship! something small and orange scampers behind a crate scanning their own Kythera sees the display for a taxidermic alien he found it's empty don't hurt me a tiny voice cries four eyes peek from behind the stowaway Kythera should have Kythera should have known that the alien statue was too good of a bargain the creature isn't dead it's just a stupid juvenile that was dared by its big brother to pretend now it's on. Now it wants a joyride around the galaxy and for a free lift home. Kythera knows he could get charged with alien napping, but it's hard to refuse the four pleading eyes. It ain't that hard to. Re nah, I'm reporting them to the cops. Ain't getting me arrested by the International Space Council. <laughs> Kythera knows it's best not to mess with the law in this quadrant. Besides, someone could have planted the kid just for an excuse to attack. The space cops pick up the four eyes and take it home, offering Kythera a small reward for his trouble. Thank you. Give me my monies. That was very small. I'm glad they said small. I mean, I could use a hundred bucks in real life with this coronavirus thing going around. Got me sitting in the house playing Sims and stuff. Oops, no. Cancel that. Cancel that. Alright, I want to see what the woohoo and the rocket looks like. That has to be the weirdest thing ever. How would you even? I mean, floating around. Oh, they actually fly? Well, that's dangerous, my guy. I thought y'all were just gonna kind of stay on the thing and have the ship shake a bit, but nah, go go fly in space and potentially die for. A decent amount. How did y'all do anything in a spacesuit? I won't question it. What do you mean, how did you do stuff in a, in a full spacesuit? How did they woohoo? Well, obviously, there's foreplay, a dummy. Uh huh, yeah. They had to take it off and be like, Yeah. Uh, the blah, blah. Sure, because they flew into outer space and, ha and were in a situation where they could take oh, off yeah. their. Breathing utensils, have a nice space quickie, and get back to the ground, and all of this safely. No. I don't believe that in the slightest, and neither should you, Rainbow. Neither should you. Meshka training, the possum Rabin. Fimpty Swippick, Skiz Oh, that hurt. Yawning hurt. What the fuck? With a charm. Baby Bully Galan. Yebony Demise. Wash. Don't Benji. Wef, wef. Simple Earth. Koba. Ah. Oh. Oh. 
Started the fight, he be knowing how dog get when dog gon' bite. It's all good, it's all right. People tried to holler, but can't holler back. Yes. My brain randomly just said, How did Neil make his smoke come out your bite marks on your back? And my brain just stopped. So I was like, What? How? Why did you ask that question, Brain? I can write love emails. Huh? Not Neil Mechanics. Yeah, Neil Mechanics, basically. Christmas crazy man, hug me, hug me, kiss and caress me. Last time I had you over, you were rude. This guy named Caleb keeps calling my sim, wanting to come over. The last time I let him come over, he was being real rude and he was a jerk. He's no longer welcomed at my household. How dare he? Slip, slip, slurp, 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 
Okay, they used to start drawing so you don't get bored. What is that? Where did that come from? How does that have anything to do with this? I ain't gonna question it. It is what it is. This is The Sims, alright? I don't, don't know what I'm expecting. My boy builds stuff while being flirty. Sims is what would happen if humans could use 100% of their brain. <laughs> no sleep. <laughs> you just unlock skill sets, max everything out once it gets to 10. Become the ultimate proficient human. Plus you have a lot less problems that way. Yeah, your biggest problem would be the toilet magically catching on fire in the middle of the night. Other than that, I can't picture any other problems. And maybe forgetting how to use the bathroom by yourself without someone telling you, because Sims be like that. They're like, I have to use the bathroom really bad. And you're like, well, use the bathroom. And they have no idea what you just told them to do. Or they forget part way through. Oh my god, Jada, you're drunk. You're drunk. You're drunk. You're drunk. Yes, you are. That's what drunk people say. No, like, it makes sense. It makes all make sense now. It's just that. How? How? Explain. How did it hurt? Hello? How did it hurt? Michael. Uh-huh. Yes. This was Neil at the ball. Height difference wise. 
No, Caleb, you're dead to me. Same height, isn't it? What? Same height as Neil. He's thick, boy. That's a thick boy. Might have to use this in real life, guys. Hold on, give me a moment. See what he's doing. I'm into the mainframe. Oh. 
<laughs> you toss the ice cubes in there? <laughs> Just ta-ta. Oh guys, for the RP, I'm going to add another chat to all the major characters called Occupation for those of us who have jobs and do actual work. Oh shit. Okay. So it'll be a way to keep up with your duties and if you want to get a second job, it'll help you keep track of what all what you're doing. Shit. 
Hey, Michael. Uh. If Waddle was ever on a smut cover. That looks creepy. That looks creepy. I think because the hands are cut off, it just looks super creepy. So I don't think you will allow you to even. So you're good. <laughs> All right, time for more cheat codes. We knew it was. That was more What's up? I wish I had a thing, but I wish it was more defined. No. Oh. If I was confident in my ability to draw mouse, I would, but like, I couldn't. Yeah, you can if you try. You said draw a, a mouth or a mouse? A mouth. Mouth. Same. Y'all can't draw mouths? That's the easier like, thing to draw. It just never looks right to me. This is what I'm talking about, Kevin. I think about I think out of everything I can't draw mouths is probably one of the few things I can yeah. Yo, oh my god my cow, the more I scroll down yo my cow, I'm scared what scared. The more I scroll down I just saw two hypnosis mic fucking <laughs> <laughs> I haven't clicked on shit my cow. I'm telling you I haven't looked it up or anything it's just the hair. And then it's the white hair guy that I like from Hypnosis Mike. Haha, uh -huh, they're calling you out. I'm just gonna scroll past it. Oh, there's a third one. They are calling. There's a third um, one. I'm avoiding it. They are calling me out, man. Hey, Kevin. Yo. When you gonna give us our beach episode? Y'all really want a beach episode for RP? Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna have to add tentacles. Wait, what? Wink, wink. No, 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 no. Don't say anything. Don't, don't repeat yourself, Kevin. Let it happen. Oh, my lord. No, I, I need I need him to, because I heard it, but I don't want to. All right. I don't think my brain registered that he actually said those words. Repeat what you just said, because apparently, no, because apparently I'm going crazy. Because apparently I'm, I'm, I hear things. So I need to make sure I didn't just hear that. Like I need to make sure that my brain did tell me what he said. I don't. I I already blocked out of my memory. I legit did. 
fucking something. Something about the beach. Something about the beach episode, man. All right. I swear to God, if that shit becomes canon, I'm gonna write it. I'm gonna fucking write it. No, 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 no. No, I'm gonna make it a canon episode. Um. Mm. Mm. I, I think I'm we, should, we should flip. We should flip a coin. Four. Just flip a coin. Okay, I'm going to the website now. Okay. I don't. I don't like flipping a coin, and I don't know what to call. How's it tails? Uh, I'm gonna flip mine. Tails. Alright, I'll automatically get heads then. Why? What was that for? Uh, I, you told me, you said to, you said to flip a coin. Yeah, yeah, you said, I said flip a coin and I said what to do. Oof. Haven't you heard that? Oh, uh, what? Tails? Yeah, she got tails. What's this for? Uh, you know, I don't even know what the coin flow for. <laughs> huh? So what you said earlier. Whoever it was, She said tails. It landed on tails. Okay. So okay. you want... So, oh, so you want this to happen to you. Okay. That's not, no. I got That's you. That's not what I said. I said, she said tails. It landed on her side. So. Mm-hmm. Happens to her. Happens to both of you together while hugging? Crazy. I'll fucking go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> you said, and you want to have it happen in great details, and I get to decide the swimsuits? Okay. I don't care if you decide the swimsuits. Ooh. I should try, probably look for that now. Look for, look for swimsuits. That line would wear. Uh -huh. it, 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 I, I can tell you now, since you're a model, Neil's death is gonna get you a swimsuit. It's not, you're not, you don't have a choice in this. In this you don't have an outfit, it's not, it's not up to you. Really letting me down now. What like what are these pursuits? Like they look ugly as shit. Yeah, I had the that one. You know what I'm about to do? Oh. Some good swimsuits. I don't know. Here, this is what I use. Oh, that's, that's good. Um, 
No, because I, I was like, oh, I know. But now I, but now it's up to me to fucking find it. And I definitely have to find Here you go, Mikkel. This is the tag I used on Pinterest. Oh, fuck. That's, no, that's just Yowie. Um. <laughs> that's just Yowie. All right, Jada. You're, you're drunk, bro. You, you need to go lay down. Yeah, what the hell? Uh, but are you are you good, son? You, you good, cuz? She's not. <laughs> there you go. She said that's just yeah, we. That just messed me up so bad for a moment. Why? I don't know. It just oh. did. <laughs> Sorry, Kevin, I'm gonna post it in the old fashioned thing because, yeah. Some of, some of these are actually pretty good. Um, I was just gonna be lazy and go with, like, fucking. Uh, one of the chromos for Caitlyn's fucking pool party skin, the city one. But wow. I could look for one. I mean, cause, I mean, cause no, like, I do like that one bathing suit she has. The one obsidian bathing suit she has, like, I actually like that one. It's pretty good. <laughs> Yeah, no, these are, these are pretty good. What's my mythology? Seven. <laughs> Oh, we know. You say it's public love. We say it's full grown. Hope that you feel this. Feel this way forever. You can plan a pretty picnic, but you can't predict the weather. Two times out of nine, a boss is not alive. Oh, the boss is over, so the boss is not declined. It never well, seems that long until you're gone. <laughs> Alright, this was fun. I'm getting off the Sims for tonight. Been on for about four hours. Yeah. 